Good evening. Good evening, dear faculties. Welcome to all and welcome to the session. Like welcome to the day three of A and ML FDP program. Just a minute. Oh, link was not shared. Uh, uh, just me, just a minute. Just a minute. now it's clear so sorry for that uh, some technical issue oh. yeah sorry I hope you I hope everyone already is very low okay Now it's okay. Now, now it's okay. Okay, it's just a minute. I hope everyone is clear. Oh, it's buffering. Okay, okay, I will check check my internet. Okay, so just a minute, just a minute, faculty, just a minute. So once I check my internet, now it's came. Okay, my side everything is clear. So, anyone said now with the live stream or not? Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. So now we continue. So once again, good evening to all and welcome to the session. Now it's okay. Oh, super, super. Thank you. Thank you so much. So now I continue. So yeah, anyone can be still buffering. Uh, once you can quit the live and rejoin the live, you can uh, maybe you can get a uh, proper uh, streaming. Okay. So last session, we were discussed about the regression model, right? So we can see the an example of car price prediction. We can see the, the example. How I will explain step by step concept, how it is happened. Today we can go with the classification, right? So that was a supervised learning concept. There are two things. One is, a, um, what is that? Um, regression, another one is the classification. Already was completely the regression. Today we can go with that classification, okay? So without delay, we can enter the concept. So classification already we known as, so SR node type, that means that was called as a classification type. And so there are algorithms already we will see. So we were seen in the last session. So the classification type is having uh, another six kind of types: logistic regression, k nearest neighbors, and support vector machines, decision trees, random forest, and uh, gradient boosting, navy bias as neural networks. The neural network is mostly used for in you know, uh, image related things. Okay, so now we can first we will see the text format. Next we can go with that uh, image format. Okay. So now I directly entering the concept, so don't waste the time. So it's a hands-on way, we can see that. So what was exactly, we can see. Okay. Um, 
I open in the Google Collab. Already yesterday I was said so how we can upload the data, how to use in the Collab. Everything I was said in the last session. Okay. Um. So, yeah, music genre prediction. We can go with that. That was interesting one. That is a less data, but we can easily understand. So how how the model can recognizing the data. So we can easily understand the concept. Okay, sorry, not this one. Okay, just a minute. Okay, um, I have to open the notebook. That name is train to speed. Yeah, that was the again buffering. Why is there, uh, everyone can same facing the same problem? Why this much time uh, the live was buffering today? There is not a much difference between the regression and the classification type. So now I will show you so how the difference will be there. Okay. Okay. So now we'll continue first. First one. Hmm. Hmm. Here, first first point. I mean, first cell. I will installing the first library. That is important libraries. Pandas, NumPy, Matplotlib. One. Already told this. Pandas helps to pre-processing library. NumPy is helps to um, uh, numerical Python handling and uh, like numerical values will handle. Matplotlib and C1 helps to create a visualization. Okay. So next I have to upload my data set that is music data set. I can go with that upload format. Same like I follow the same procedure uh, files and upload our data set. Get it from a Kaggle already data set is have. Yeah, I have music folder. I individually have the data set. So that's why I'm using that. Yeah, Seaborn is also same like that. So the difference between the Matplot and Seaborn means Matplotlib is working for same uh, both uh, array as well as data set both concept we can use in the matplotlib but the c bond is only applicable for uh, data set so like the table we can using now we can using the table format like table frames or data frames that is the difference between matplot and c bond okay so now i run this so once you have you have to see the like, data set so this is our data set, the age and gender wise journal prediction. So age and gender wise, which in this people, which kind of journal they have to interest. So multi-class classification, we can say it like in multi-class classification. Already we know the class, the classification is having yes or no type, like that was called as a binary. So this or that, like that only. So there is a the additional thing is there, that is a multi-class classification. There is uh, two or three more uh, values is there, that is called as a multi-class. So here the multi-class, there is a hip hop, jazz and a classical and a dance. So from, I think around uh, six, six kind of genres is there. Once we will check in, uh, I mean, uh, once entering the uh, data set showing, we will see that is a six kind of genres is there. 
so based on the journal uh, sorry age and uh, gender wise this people which kind of journal they have to interest is a very less data to prediction is uh, easy to understanding also so that's why i choosing this so now i upload the data then i have to showing that so music dot head of 20 right yeah so i think is more or less uh, 80 yeah 18 uh, data only 18 entries only is there so you can see that the age is an around 20 starting age is to 20 to so maximum is uh, 36 35 yeah so 0 1 means already the data set having yes i mean uh, 0 or 1 value so 1 means female or 0 means male like that way so we have to see so which one is that so you can go with the Kaggle. you can see the difference between the um, so you can see the data's value so one is which one is representation and uh, zero is which one is which kind of value is represented so music journal prediction yeah yeah it's there Here multiple values is there. So here the individual data sets already I have choosing in the different platform I think. So I will share that for now purpose we can um, for our understanding for our training purpose we can use this. In later, I will share the data set and everything will share to you so you can uh, easily understand about uh, how it is working. Okay, now I explain first. Okay. Yeah. So almost 18 entries only is there. Right? So you can, why I said like that, I mean, I can call 20 entries. I mean, 20 rows I have to execute. But the uh, values are entry only 17 index uh, almost 18 rows very less data only is there that, that was i can uh, using the 20 first 20 so tail also same like that if i can calling the tail that also executed the same format um okay watch it uh, yeah music so music dot tail that was executed the last one So now not, nothing different between the head and tail because of it's a very less data so that's why it's happening next we have check out the shape so 18 rows and three columns age gender and genre and value counts of the each column the age is value count so 20 age people so there are two people and 26 age pe age is a two people 25 age is two people because why i can check the continuous values here because the age column is a continuous column i mean the regression column that means because the age is there right so why I check the value counts here means the very less data that's why we can easily identify uh, in case it's having a much data means above 100 or above 200 or 500 like that means we cannot uh, um, see the count of like value counts of the age so it's very less only 18 entry is there so that's why we can easily understand the count of uh, age peoples so other 21 23 other ages are only one peoples is there in that particular age so next I can go with the gender, so male or female like that. Sorry, genre, yeah, right. So classical is a six type of classical people, they like the classical genre, and the three people are like acoustic, like uh, acoustic genre, and dance is and three people like the dance genre, and the three people like the hip hop genre, and the three people like the jazz jazz. So almost five kind of types only is there. I said the six and is nearly only five types. Five kind of genre like genre only is there. Next we can go with the gender. So male and female. So almost 18. So equally 9 and 9. So 9 female and 9 male. That's what it's executed. We can check the information. So the information already you know. So we can. Which kind of format the data frame is there. And how much entries. Starting and ending range. And column names. Null values. And data type. So here the age and gender is a null value. They're like uh, numbers. That was an integer. Journal is only mentioned like a text. In case gender is. Uh, in case of the 0 or 1s, they have represent to the male or female, that was the object. So here we can, we need to convert the values, like transform the values. But now no, now no need because of already the gender is having a 1 or 0 like that. So in the sum of value, it helps to identify the count of null values, it's still 0 because there is a no null values. And duplicate values, sum of duplicate 
because the duplicate value is also not there so that was empty like this zero like the values are zero so again we have to check the genre of value counts now we can execute it in the visualizing format so sns dot scatter plot of age and genre hue also mentioning like a genre because we need a identification of equal e each genre so now we can see Starting to age is 20, maximum age is 36 or age in 35, right? So you can see the individually the genre has to be classified here. So the blue color is hip hop, and the orange color is jazz, and the uh, sorry, green color is a classical, red color is a dance, and the violet is an acoustic. So 20 age people, the most are interested into the dance, dance genre. 20 age people and 21 age people, and 25 age people. So they this particular age people insert interested in a dance genre. As well as the 20 age people are interested in the hip hop. So first you can age wise we can go with that. 20 age people are one people inter interested in the dance. One another people interested in the interest in the hip hop. As well as the 22 age people uh, mostly interested in the uh, hip hop only. And 25 age people is a dance as well as hip hop. And 26 age people are acoustic plus jazz. So like that way age wise how much sorry they have which kind of genre they have to interested. The dot wise we can easily identify that next we can go with that uh, count plot like how much genre is there so count of genre so classical is a six piece classical genre is there and uh, another equal or so other values are equally split into the three three format that is four three inside 12 and uh, 12 plus 6 is 18 okay so the individually they have represented the colors because I mentioned in the hue, 